Um, right now I'm doing a capture screen. Of course, it's not a 4K capture uh, on uh, my iMac. Uh, you know, I don't care if you're a PC user or a Mac user. I mean, uh, well, let's just face it. Uh, a, little, yeah, a 4K monitor for a PC is not that expensive. And as far as looking at... This is a picture I took today. Um, as far as looking at your pictures, editing your pictures, I mean... Mm, well, I mean, three hundred and fifty dollar investment. Eh, say, let's say four hundred fifty dollars for a professional four K display. You know, I'm not about spending money, but mm, well, it kind of is a principle that if you're going to be editing your photographs and you want to see what they really, really look like, um, that's as kind of close as a necessity, as uh, you know. I mean, let, let's be honest. I mean, really? I mean, are, are we really going to uh, dispute that fact? I mean, these look so much... I don't care what you care think about the pictures, but I mean, these look so much different than on my other display. I just... I can't go back. I cannot go back to a regular display. It's just something to consider. You know, maybe your birthday is coming up, or uh, your significant other, like, uh, owes you a favor. You're like, uh, hey, baby. How about you get me a 4K display? <laughs> it makes a big difference. <clears throat> it really does. I mean, is anybody going to dispute that fact? So anyway, something to consider, right? You're all, you're all. Someone out there is going like, "Oh no, you're just talking about spending money." No, I'm, I'm, I'm not talking about spending money. Yeah, I was out taking a shot today, and there was a brief rainstorm, and then went right back out and like 200% humidity. These are high-speed sync shots out of the Fuji X100T. Anyway, yeah, they're not that exciting, but uh, anyway, 4K display. Goodbye.